Yes lads and welcome back to the Brighton Rebuild. And in this episode as you can see on the right we play Bournemouth but it's not only just Bournemouth. We also play Cambridge in the Cup. And I'm really not sure which one to do. I don't have to play Bournemouth or play Cambridge. I, I, I really really want to play Cambridge. And you're probably thinking why is that? It's going to be an easy win. We drew against Athens in the last minute. There, there are no easy wins in football anymore. But this is the starting eleven against Bournemouth at home. We will be sibbing Bournemouth and playing Cambridge. I'm sorry if you want to see me play Bournemouth, but you're gonna have to well, you're gonna have to watch me play Cambridge instead. We've got Verbruggen, Valman, Webster, Dunk, Estupinan, uh, Jean Neves, at least said Ruben Neves, uh, Billy Gilmore, James Milner. I'm having a stinker with these names today. Uh, Mytoma, March, and Evan Ferguson up top. We need to beat Brighton. Simple as that. And we don't beat Brighton, but a one all draw is better than a loss. And Jao Pedro's first goal for the club comes at a pretty important time. But of course, Sinistera scores. Or, yeah. I love Sinistera. And this is the starting eleven in the Carabao Cup. I can't remember what round it is, but it doesn't matter what round it is. It's nowhere near the final. It's literally the first round we can play in. But we've got Verbruggen, Voutman, Webster, Van Hecke, Estupinan, Lalana, Balerba. Pascal Gross in the front three, Jao Pedro, Ansu Fati, and a pretty tired Welbeck. I could even do this, and that is exactly what I'm going to do. Welbeck's on the bench, Bonanati is on the right, and Jao Pedro is up top. Come on! And here we are, the American Express Stadium. I'm still going to call it the Amex. I do not care. Bart Verbruggen is still in goal because he's the number one. I don't care about Jason Steele. I put my complete and utter trust... In the Belgian man himself. Belgian kid himself. I don't know how old he is, but I don't think he's old. But playing Cambridge at home. We just drew Athens 2-2. We just drew Bournemouth 1-0. This could be anything. But Jao Pedro deserves a, a, a an upfront start. He scored his first goal for the club last time out. And he might be scoring his second goal for the club. Not just yet. Not just yet, but... He's done more than he has before. Adam Webster. Oh. Voutman to Pascal Gross. The man, the man with the, the, the wand of a right foot. Genuinely, the wand. Oh, the wand. The German fucking wand. Oh. Ansu Fati. Running the uh, Kadena. Back to Jao Pedro. To Adam Lallada. Oh, my God. If he wasn't 34 and had one leg, he would have fucking scored. Ansu Fatty, come on, baby. I don't know why I called him baby, but I don't care. If he's going to score, I'll call him whatever he wants me to call him. Ansu Fatty, to make it! Oh, my lord. Just put it in the back of the net. It's fucking Cambridge. You've run the whole pitch just to send it fucking wide, man. I ain't calling you baby anymore. Bruno and Natty's done well. It'd be nice if he could score a goal, but I also don't trust him that much because he's only 71 rated. Belebo. Belebo's been a good CDM at the minute. Pascal Gross. Pascal Gross into but Labour. Oh. Pascal Gross, man, just does everything right. Like I, 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 I don't believe I've seen Pascal Gross do anything wrong at this moment in time. Oh, if that would have went in, man, I would have took everything off. Bonanati, Bonanati, to Jao Pedro. Do I pass it? Do I shoot? I know what I'm gonna. Oh. Should have passed it. Should have passed it. Jao Voltman, Jao, what? Joel Voltman is knackered. Terry Clamps is coming on before half time. Got nothing to do with Voltman's performances. It's just the fact that if I, if I play for five more minutes, he may die. Bruno Natty. Bruno Natty. Come on. And to Ansu Fat, he plays it through to Jao Pedro. It's a poor first touch. It's a terrible first touch. Donkey. Absolute donkey. But Pascal Gross is on the corner. And when Pascal Gross is on the corner. Oh, oh, yes! Adam Webster, finally! It only took 13 shots. It only took 13 shots to finally score. And who scores? It's a fucking centre-back. And it's not even going to count as a Pascal Gross assist. But at least we're winning. At least we are winning. Adam Webster with a good first header. And then great reactions to get the ball past Ibsen and Rossi. What a name. And whoever the goalkeeper scored. But not spending money on ultimate team. I am pure, even though I bought the ultimate edition, which is more money, but shut up. 
I am pure RTG. And I'm pure career mode, baby. I don't give a fuck about Ultimate Team when it comes to this top, this part of the year. Andrew Fatty, the only thing I care about is scoring goals with players I'm never ever going to see in my life play. But it, it doesn't matter. If Andrew Fatty's going to do that! Oh! <laughs> João Pedro. This is why you love career mode, baby. You do not see that in Ultimate Team. You see nothing like that in Ultimate Team. All you see is sweat and fat men. Career mode is the place to be. Ansu Fati, what the fuck is happening? Ansu Fati with the Traveller. Oh, and João Pedro with a fucking bicycle kick. It's his second goal for the club. He's been terrible. But it doesn't matter anymore. A clean, state, a clean slate. He's a new man. He is a new Brazilian man. Oh, Van Hecke. 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 João Pedro to Ansu Fati. Anthony Fatty, do another Traveller. You won't. You won't! Oh, Bruno Nassi is just not that guy, man. And now I've got to worry about Jean Pedro getting a red card because I'm a stupid man. Oh, my Toma. Or my Toma. Oh, Belega. Belaba, sorry. He's done very well this game. And so is Anthony Fatty! Oh! He's got two assists, man. Two assists, two crosses. Two Travellers. You just can't. You just you can't really top it. I guess you can top it. You can get a you can get a hat trick of assists with Travellers, but there's only one way to find out if that happens, and it's the Oh, wait. Get it get it over to Anzu Fatty. Get it over to Anzu Fatty. What a pass burn on Natty. Oh, there's no way! Oh <laughs> Ah! Ansu Fatty, I know, I, I literally, ha I, I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Ansu Fatty! Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, I had that planned the whole time. Pascal Gross, whip it in. Whip it in. On top of João Pedro. That's a terrible cross, to be fair. But it was, I was the one who aimed it. So, I'm not going to moan at Pascal Gross for that one. But that is it for this game. 3-0. Ansu Fatty has to be man of the match. If anybody else is man of the match, this game is lying. I mean, João Pedro did score a bicycle kick, but other than that, he didn't actually do anything. But Ansu Fati must be man of the match. He, he, yeah, he, he got a 10. He got a 10. João Pedro, 8.3. Fati, 10. B -b -b -buen on Buena Nate, 8.5. Pascal Gross, 9. Van Heck, 8.1. Webster, 9.2. Oh, it's, 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 it's a good team, this one. It's a good team, this one. Oh, imagine if United went out. Imagine if Liverpool went out. Oh, not going to happen, though. But thank you all so much for watching this episode and game. Well, actually, there were two games. We drew to Bournemouth and then played an absolute beautiful game against Cambridge in the Cup. But next time out, we play Villa and Marseille. Hmm. It might be another Sim, Sim the League play Europa League. Because I'm not going to lie, I, I want to play Villa because they're first. But I also, I also want to play Marseille because I don't think I'm going to beat Marseille if I sim them. But either way, ugh, excuse me, the only way to find out is coming back next episode. And half of my team are knackered. Let me see, match day, who's knackered? Mate, I've just, I've been manager for f five episodes. Shut your fucking mouth. Anyway. Enough with the negativity, Adam Lallana. You know what? Adam Lallana, just because you're so incredibly negative and you are 35, goodbye, you prick. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching this one. Next time out, we get into the league, leaders, and then Marseille, who are definitely no team to scoff at. They have Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. I'll see you all in the next one.